news that we are breaking to you Delhi police has, police has issued a statement on Disha Ravi and the cops say Disha is a key conspirator in the toolkit case also accused Disha of sharing toolkit with Greta Thunberg Delhi police says Disha asked Greta to remove the main document there was a, that's a, uh, that's what had happened first time that toolkit was uploaded it was deleted and that was re-uploaded activist Disha started the WhatsApp group as well and collaborated to make the toolkit document. Alok Singh joining us on the phone line. Alok, it seems the Delhi police has given out details on the role and level of uh, involvement of Disha Ravi in designing the toolkit. Over to you for the details. Uh, yes, absolutely. In fact, uh, it is said that uh, uh, she had made a WhatsApp group to collaborate uh, to make the toolkit document. Remember, this is a document which was completely a copycat uh, that all, all, what all had happened on 26th of January. Uh, so uh, she was the one who made the WhatsApp group. She started herself the WhatsApp group. So uh, what the Delhi police believe that she is one of the creators of this document. This is Google document that was uploaded on the social media and later given to Greta Thunberg, uh, which uh, Greta Thunberg uh, in fact uploaded uh, the, from her uh, from her uh, Twitter handle. This is what the Delhi police says. Uh, in fact, they also said that uh, this uh, they all co co collaborated with the pro Khalistani uh, Poetic Justice Foundation to spread this affection against the Indian state. Uh, she was the one who uh, shared the tool toolkit uh, document with the Greta Thunberg. This is what the Delhi police has uh, categorically said uh, in their statement. So what we can believe uh, that uh, Delhi police is trying to say that she is uh, she is one of the conspirators uh, of uh, she is one of the conspirators of the toolkit case. And definitely there are more people who are on the radar of the Delhi police, and they will also be arrested very soon. Right. So when you say there are more people, is there any other details? Because it seems that uh, this, she is part part of a climate activist group called Friday for Future and uh, Srija was also telling us earlier that their Bangalore-based group believe that this is a case of crushing dissent. Uh, two before the court, one is Shantanu and another is uh, Nikita Jacob. What we are learning that, that Nikita Jacob is uh, from uh, Mumbai and another person Shantanu is, uh, is also uh, somewhere outside the Delhi, who is based in outside in Delhi. So definitely those people who are uh, staying outside uh, outside the national capital or they are living in various other parts of the uh, various other parts of the country, they uh, they are the part of this whole alleged conspiracy and uh, they are on the radar. Uh, in fact, in the court, uh, Delhi police said that these two persons are also the part of the conspiracy and they are looking for them. Uh, so that is why uh, we are saying that many people are on the radar as I already told you that uh, uh, that uh, Disha Ravi is one of the editors of uh, of this toolkit. So there are many people who are the part of making this, uh, making this toolkit and uploading on the social media.